back to EA Sports. I'm James Cebulski, and a couple of heavyweights in Europe are ready to duke it out tonight on the ice. And we are about set to drop the puck on this one. The Lakers kick things off by winning the opening faceoff, and here we go. Quick feed to McLaughlin, and it goes off a stick. In front of the net, the goaltender covers up for a whistle on the play. Lots of time left in this period. Still scoreless in this one. While the centers are jammed up, nice job by the winger to steal the puck. Keeps possession. Grabs the puck. Up the neutral zone now. And he takes the pass. Vexhouse got the puck. The Lakers will play it from the defensive zone. Into the attacking area from the left side. Moves it around along the half wall. Coughs it up on the play. The Lakers. Oh my goodness, it stayed out. What a save. It was all but in James. And that athleticism and the will to get to that puck, that was on display. A goaltender, they have to have talent, they have to have mobility, they have to be able to track the puck, but they have to have a willingness to find it and fight for any second shot, and that's exactly what happens here. Out battling, out willing, and you make the save. The Red Bulls have it now. Gains the zone through the middle. And that's intercepted by McLaughlin. Takes the feed. Munich's got possession at center. Moves the puck. Munich's got it in their own zone. Moves it to Person. Backtracks with the puck, but maintains possession. Carlson's got it in the defensive end. Great pass from off the right side. And now it's grabbed by McLaughlin. Pokes it away in his own end. Puts it on net. Denies him in front. Wow. He scores! Jumps on the rebound. Count. You're taught when you're a little kid that you have to protect the interior of the ice. The defender caught way outside the dots. Has to hustle back to get to that coverage, and by then it's too late. Moves it to the middle. Oh, he comes up with a stop. The Lakers have been the better team in this first period. More scoring opportunities, and as a result, more goals. Nice job tying up his opponent. And that's just out of reach. The Lakers gain possession. Munich's got possession here in the neutral zone. Skates across the blue line. The Red Bulls looking against the half wall. Centering pass! to backtrack here in the play. Quick feed down low. And that was stopped. The Red Bulls carry it along the wall. And that's a smart heads-up play by Carlson. Runs him hard into the wall. Taken along the wall by Smith. Looking to make something happen at center. Drives to the sweet spot. Going to the frame. Pexhaus ahead, 1 0. They take possession as he locks him up off the faceoff and makes the save. And the goaltender grabs that one for a whistle to try to slow things down here. And the centers glide towards the dot here as we got a faceoff set to go. Good job tangling up his opponent here. Sends the pass in front, and that's stopped. And that slides right out to center ice. Picked up along the wall by Street. The Red Bulls move the puck in the defensive zone. Driving right to the front. 
Oh, he'll feel that one. And you can hear these fans calling for a shot in the dying seconds. And he's got the answer for that one. 20 minutes in the books. Let's grab a breather and we'll come back with period number two in moments. A clean sheet of ice beckons and period number two set to get underway. Here we go, middle frame now underway as the puck drops. Well, Cheryl, we got 20 minutes under our belts in this one. How do you sum up the performance? Munich's had the puck a ton in that opening frame, James. That's exactly what you want if you're the coach. You want to manage the puck. You want to own it in the offensive zone. They did just that. They just weren't able to convert. They find themselves trailing by one. If they can trust the process, they'll find their way back into this game. Here's a shot. Makes the save with the chopper. Persons lugging the puck. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Here's a shot. Crouching down to knock it away. Here's a short pass to McLaughlin. Munich's got a hold of the puck now. Drives to the paint. And the save. Vexal's looking to break out of their own end. Looking dangerous as they move along the boards. Munich's got possession of the puck. Exploring options here inside the defensive zone. Carries it into the offensive end up the middle. To his teammate. Pass back to the point. Goaltender gave up nothing as it hits the outside of the post and will play on. Still lots of time left in the period. Pexhouse up one zip. Great read by the winger to take possession with the two centermen tied up. Sends the pass down low. Slides it back to the blue line. Cuts to the front. Quick pass to Smith. Centering feed. Another pass. More than half the frame has been played here. We got a 1-0 game to this point. Slides in off the wing after the centerman tied him up. The Red Bulls gain control of the puck. A belt shell stick handling in his own zone. Keeps a hold of it on the play. Munich's got a hold of it along the wall. Moves it quickly over to McWilliam. Into the attacking end. Moves the puck down low. The Lakers have it against the wall. Looking for space inside the D zone. From the left side, he moves it up ahead. The Red Bulls have it from their own end. Munich's looking to break out. Here they come on the attack. Takes it right in the chest. And we're going to get a stoppage here as the referee blows the play dead. The Red Bulls have had more opportunities tonight, but at some point they need to start finishing here late in period number two. Smart play to take possession, sneaking in off the wing. To the front! Jocelyn to the puck and he loses control. Second period nearly into its final minute here. Munich's working the puck near the point. Grabs the puck. Back to the point, it goes. Oh, spectacular save right there. Wow. Unbelievable. I mean, it was all but in, and he steals it because of that last-ditch attempt to find the puck. Just incredible save, James. The moment of truth has arrived for both these teams. Third period action set to go. And the puck is dropped, and we are underway here in the third. Two-thirds of the way to the finish line, and this one for regulation time. Cheryl, 
How do you view it? Munich's had a lot of pace and tempo through the first 40 minutes of play, James, and if they can continue that along with their possession time, you got to believe that they can get the equalizer in this one. We got a whistle. Penalty coming up. Tough spot to be in. You need momentum, and you give it back by going on the PK when you're trailing by one. And the man advantage unit comes out to go to work. First power play opportunity for this team. It's going to start in the face-off circle, getting possession with the win, and then looking to set up. Moves inside! Poked away in the defensive end. And there's the save! The Red Bulls have possession shorthanded. Here they come inside the neutral zone. The Lakers take possession in the defensive end. Gaining momentum along the wing. Takes the feet at the back end. Big time stop. I really like to save James because he challenges the shooter who's all alone in the slot area. He turns aside a real dangerous opportunity. And he comes up with it. Larmy's got the puck and he's going to hang on for a whistle. Well, there's only one reason that this game is tight, James. It's the guy between the crease. He elects to hold on to that one. He has been dynamite. Smith's gliding in for the face-off as this penalty kill will continue. Oh, and he takes possession of the puck from off the wing with the centers all locked up there off the draw. Puck grab by Smith. And that's off a stick. Solid effort by the penalty killing unit as the power play comes up empty. Well, trailing in this game, James, this was a huge kill. They couldn't lose touch of the game, and they did an awesome job of killing that off. Munich's had plenty of good looks offensively, but they cannot convert trailing early in the third. Well, that's one way to win the draw as he skates away with the puck after the two centers were tied up. Puck sails out of the bench, sending a few people ducking. Nearing the midway mark of the period. 1-0 the score. Sneaks away with the puck after he was tangled up on the draw. The Red Bulls take possession of the neutral zone. He's got a step. Oh, he can't pull the trigger on the play. Well, it's because he skated himself into no man's land, ran out of real estate and gets nothing for it. Thank you. like that one back. Makes a move in front. And a delayed penalty coming up as he got tripped up. Let's see the call here. Anytime you lose position on your opponent, this can happen. He gets the sticks out in the feet of his opponent, and guess what? He gets the tripping ball. Rex House power play unit puts their hard hats on as they go back to work. Earlier today, the guys were talking about the cross crease one-timer. The coverage is sliding over to one side of the ice. It's opening it up all day long. Receives the pass. Sends a pass over. Here's the pass. Lormy's got the puck and hangs on for a whistle here in this third period. Well, he's been one of their best players all night. A reason why they're leading here in the third, James. But it's not just about the save. It's about managing the puck and making the decisions when to hold on. Takes possession of the puck off the draw. Grabs the puck. Slides the puck down low. That opportunity is rejected. There's the whistle as the puck is frozen up. McLaughlin's looking to win this draw and this man advantage here. And with the centers tied up, he swoops in to take possession. Can't keep a hold of the puck after that play. Can't get a hold of that pass. The Lakers have it now. Retrieves the puck, trying to kickstart this power play. Slick feed. Poked away in the neutral zone. Munich's got a hold of it against the wall. Parks is now standing, ready to get back on the ice. And the power play unit comes up empty on that one. Although they're still trailing, this game is now within reach with that effective kill. That gives life to the entire bench. Quick feed to Eisenschmidt. Cuts to the paint with the stop. In front and a stoppage on the play as the goaltender covers things up. More than half the period has expired. The Lakers lead it 1-0. Swoops in off the wing to grab the puck after the centerman tied him up. Oh, and a misfire as that goes right out of the zone. Along the half wall with the puck. Centering feed! And that doesn't go as it's off a stick. 
The Lakers picking up ahead of steam on the breakaway. He scores! Oh, wow, what a finish! Well, I love that he used his feet and didn't slow down, James. And then it's all about patience and composure, outleading the goaltender, finding the room and burying it. Man, is he ever flying, James? It looks like everyone else is in quicksand, and he is moving. He gets on his horse. He's in all alone, one-on-one -on -one with the goaltender. He doesn't freak out. He doesn't panic. Shows a ton of confidence and lets that shot rip. Munich's had a lot to like about their game tonight. Decided advantage in the shot department, but they still trail here in the third. Parks grabs the puck inside his own territory. And he takes the dish. Handles the pass. Angles it over to a belt Schauser. Trying to gain a step. All alone. Buries it for the goal. Well, he does a great job of exploiting the weakness of the coverage, and he finds a way to break away from the pack. He's in on the breakaway, James. And what a battle it is. It's one that he wins, and he drives the puck home. Here in the late goings of the period, Rexhouse has been showing relentless pressure lately, now up by three. Along the right wall, and into the offensive end. Sends it down low, and he comes up with a stop there. Narmi's had a quiet night, James, and him watching most of the game from the other end because of the offensive nature of his team tonight. But man, does he make a nice save there, and that's showing that he's emotionally engaged. He's staying prepared, even though he hasn't been busy. And he takes the feed. Moves it to Reeder. Looking to make something happen along the boards. Moves the pass in front. And he denies that great opportunity there. Up along the wing. Into the offensive end now. The Red Bulls play it along the wing. Here's a pass down low. will now open because you know that they've had a real effective game. They've been hard on the puck. It just hasn't gone in for them, James, but they haven't gotten frustrated. They've stuck with the game plan, and here they are. The Red Bulls have had more scoring chances, and yet they trail late in this third period. And they win that draw at center. And he takes the feed. Takes a hit, but still hangs on to the puck. Takes the pass. Handles the puck. Couldn't catch up to that pass. That's all she wrote from this one. Cheryl, this is one of those games that the analytics departments will look at and say, the math doesn't add up here. Uh, and sometimes it's about the eye test. When you look up at the scoreboard, yeah, they're victorious in this one. They didn't have the majority of possession time, but they attacked well, and they were opportunistic with the chances they did get. They're giving us the go-home cue, so we're going to get out of here. Thanks so much for joining, and we'll see you next time here on EA Sports.
Two absolute global heavyweights based in Europe are set to collide on the ice tonight. It's Champions League action here on EA Sports. A lot of bounce on both blue lines here, and we are about set to drop the puck here at center. The Panthers start things off on the right note by winning the opening draw. And a smart heads-up read to come up with the puck. Takes it across the blue line. Takes the shot. Oh, comes up with a kick save. And he hangs on to the puck. Takes it to the front. Here's the shot. Gets down to block it. Through the neutral zone, moving the puck along the side. Sends it over. Passes out front. And he shuts down a great scoring chance there. Lots of hockey left to be played in this period. We're still scoreless. Locks them up on the draw as they take possession. Loves the puck into the corner of the offensive zone. Big time defensive play. Penalty coming up as the play's blown dead. Well, you can see him shaking his head and arguing with the official, James, but they're not changing their mind. This is a penalty. Ingolstadt's man advantage unit will take to the ice for the first time tonight. First power play opportunity of the game and to set the tempo, the trend on the specialty team unit. Two on oh, here we go. Takes it to the net. One more pass. And that's out of reach and out of the offensive zone. Through center along the wing. Moves the puck along the half wall. And he caught him when he wasn't looking. What a hit. Some players get into the game by physically engaging early. There's a fine line there, but that was executed perfectly. Takes the feed. Moves into the offensive zone. Sends the feed in front. Oh, and he comes up with a stop. Another big face-off looming as this power play rolls on here tonight. Ingolstadt's got the puck after winning the defensive zone face-off. Burger's up and ready to get back on the ice. Ingolstadt's got it in their own zone. Both sides back to even strength. A great effort by the penalty killers there. Well, the power play unit looks stifled out there, and they have to make adjustments and read off what the PK unit is doing, and there was none of that. Grabs it in his own end. Sends the pass over. Right up Main Street and on the attack. Moves into the slot. Grabs the puck in the corner. Back to the blue line. Moves close to the point. Ingolstadt's got the puck in the defensive end. Looking for space inside the D zone. Slides the puck over. Through the neutral zone now, picking up steam. Grabbed along the board by Olsen. He takes a moment to backtrack, but maintains possession. Takes the feed from the left side. Here's a pass in front, and that's stopped. Taken by St. Dennis. Knocks the puck loose after a solid hit. On the attack along the boards. Handles it along the blue line. Takes the puck. Slides the puck down low. With possession along the wall. And a poke check knocks the puck away. Here's the chance to set up now. Back at the point, they set it up. The Panthers will play it in their own end. Slides the puck across to St. Denis. First period is in the books. The next 20 minutes is on deck next here on EA Sports.
We are about ready to get underway here for the second period. Advantage goalies for the first 20 minutes. Let's see if we get a goal here in the second. Well, Cheryl, already a third of this one played. What do you make of this one? Kosice is playing hard, but not smart, James, with the puck. They've mismanagement multiple times, and they're lucky they haven't gotten burned, and this is still a scoreless game. Penalty coming up here. Once the stick engages at the lower half of the leg or within the skates, you know it's going to be a tripping call. The Panthers once again send out their power play unit. They haven't scored on the power play yet, but they have another opportunity. The key to this one, gain possession so they can set up. His reflexes on display tonight. Can hang on to the puck after taking a knock. Looks to set up at the point now. Centering feed! And he'll hang on to it to regroup here for a moment. And he makes a save on that play. Into the offensive end right up the middle. Handles the puck at the point. Here in the corner, he grabs the puck. Here's the chance. And there's the save. Great positioning by the goaltender to redirect it to the corner, getting it out of danger. That one's off the blocker. And a stick in the lane ends that threat. The Panthers get nothing here on this power play. We're back to even strength. Well, when you get the nod to hit, hit the ice on a power play, you want to execute at least 20% of the time, and all these players are heading back to the bench, and they're deflated. Lots of time left in this period. The game is still scoreless. Off the trot, he ties up his opponent. He drives it to the crease. Turns that one away. Takes that pass back at the point. Quick feed down low. And yeah, refs don't like that. There's the whistle as the net comes off. We haven't even hit the midway mark of the period. We've still got zeros on the board. And from off the wing, he comes up with it with both centers scrummed up. The Panthers played along the boards. And he takes a shot. Oh, he'll feel that one later on, but what a block. And he can't hang on after that hit. Inside the offensive zone. The Panthers scoop it up along the boards. Takes the bank pass feed. Cuts into the paint. Great save from in tight. Well, this is an incredible save, James. It's anticipation as well. Recognize that the shooter is in the low slot, getting in front of it and making the save. Gaining speed through center, and here they come on the attack. Takes the feed at the point. And he takes the pass. Locks him. Ingolstadt's got a hold of the puck. Sends it over to Berger. Takes the feed. Comes up with the stop. And we get a whistle as the goaltender decides to hang on to this one. Here in the back half of this period, still looking for our first goal. Good job tangling up his opponent here. Cutting to the slot. Blocker saved by the goalkeeper. To the point. Moves around along the half wall. Moves the puck. Into the corner of the attacking area. Slides it back to the blue line. Eagle Scott's gained possession along the boards. The Panthers will play from the defensive zone. From along the walls, they're gaining momentum. Look out, here they come on the attack. Oh, what a save. He stopped it. Wow. Oh, that's an intangible effort that you can't teach, James. That's all about desperation and the will to stop that puck. Feeds it down low. Oh, what a save on the play. Whoa. He's doing absolutely everything he can to keep his team in this game, James. Unbelievable save. 
And there's the horn. Two down, one more to go. Both teams will get a chance to uh, catch their breath and get ready for a big third period next. 40 minutes in the books. Big third period coming up for both teams, and we're ready to go. We might start approaching the next goal win sort of department here as we are underway in the third, still scoreless. Comes up with the stop. We got a whistle as the puck's frozen. Still plenty of time left in this frame. Still no score in this one. Nice job tying up his opponent. Moves it to the middle. And he denies that great opportunity there. Slides it across to Bodie. Moves along the boards with some purpose. Dumps it in. Scoops up the puck here. Now he takes it over the line. Skates to the crease. Decides to think about it. Berger's going to play it against the half wall. Grabs the puck here inside the offensive end. Lugs the puck into the offensive zone corner. Quick feed down low. Sends the pass down low. Back to the point it goes. Just a smothering attack here in the offensive end. And listen to this place light up. And they'll skate it out of the zone. Ingolstadt's on the attack. Takes it into the slot. Huge opportunity there, James, to get the go-ahead goal in this game. You know what that does? It creates a ton of momentum, but the bite stops it. Receives the pass. The center feed! And he shuts down a great scoring chance there. Huge steal in his own end. Slides it quickly to Simpson. Here's a chance! All oh, the officials saw that trip, and the hand is up. And they're going to be shorthanded once again, much to the chagrin of these fans. What is that? Is that three in a row now? Yeah, that's three in a row. You got it. And the fans certainly don't like it, but it's not up to them, is it? But now they're back to the PK. So difficult to get any kind of flow in a game when you're marching to the penalty box. Along the wing, up the neutral zone. Stopped by the goaltender. Takes the feed from his netminder. Looking to break out here on the power play. Well, this game looks like it's going right down to the wire, James. And one of the most important things to do now is make sure you make good blue line decisions. Broken up with the stick in the defensive zone. Streaking through center, they go on the attack. Centering pass! Only oh, comes up with a stop. Edwards has it in the defensive end. Jumps the puck in. Here inside the defensive zone, they get the puck. Ahead of steam now towards the front. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Time's up on the power play. Both teams back to even strength. Well, that power play wasn't very good, James. It's really slow and methodical and easy read for the PK unit. You got to fight to find something in the middle ice and get some shots on net. Off the draw and a nice job locking up his opponent. Here's a short pass to Olsen. Tries to the crease. Denied by the goaltender. Takes the feet at the back end. Centering feed. Oh, and he keeps it here. Sends a pass over. Moves the puck down low. Back to the blue line. The Panthers gain control of the puck against the wall. Slick feed. The Panthers are on the attack. Ingolstadt's got it along the wall. Takes a shot. Oh, gets a little piece of it and keeps it out of the net. Olsen's picking up steam. Slides the puck down low. Goaltender covers it up and we'll get a reset here. A critical draw here.
They take possession as he locks him up off the faceoff. Handles it along the blue line. Takes it to the net. And that goes off his blocker. Ingolstadt's got the puck. And he takes the dish. Well, there you go. 60 minutes played, and now we're going to head to overtime. Not all heroes wear capes. Some of them have skates. We'll find out who the hero is next. Players are back on the ice. They're set as of the officials. Overtime. Let's find out.